This is Michael Good from ReaperTrades.com with a short tutorial on the basics of short selling with interactive brokers and the mechanics of actually submitting the orders. Let's say you want to short sell a stock and it's easy to borrow. You just create the order, transmit it, and then boom, you get filled. You can route it to whichever market you want. 95% of the time, I smart route it. IB has a very good smart router, you'll get good fills. Don't worry about where it gets sent. You can choose to route to a bunch of different ECNs and to different marketplaces like the New York Stock Exchange, Island is the NASDAQ. I get filled a lot through ARCA, BATS, Direct Edge sometimes. It's very rare that I actually direct route to an ECN or to a market. One of the few times I do that is when I'm trading a New York Stock Exchange stock that is only traded by a specialist on the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. And there's very, very few New York Stock Exchange stocks that do that. One of the few is Berkshire Hathaway. So let's say I want to short 10,000 shares of Berkshire Hathaway, A shares, and 10,000 times the $100,000 per share price means what? That would be, um, be a lot of money. <laughs> So rather than smart routing, I'd send it directly to the New York Stock Exchange and it would go to the specialist on the floor and I'd get filled a little bit faster. But almost all the other times just smart route, you'll get filled faster and better than if you route directly to an ECN or to a market. Now let's say you're shorting something where there aren't enough shares to short. Let's say I want to short 10,000 Auntie and I'll short it at 555 here. I submit the order and then you immediately see this is dark green and there's little binoculars there. And then if you mouse over that it shows shares for this order aren't immediately available. The order will be held while we attempt to locate the shares. And that will happen That will happen even if there are a number of shares but not as much as you want. So if there were 9,000 shares of this and I tried to short sell 10,000 shares it would still hold my entire order. That's one thing I don't like about IB. I wish it would fill you on whatever shares it had. So it helps to know how many shares are available beforehand so that you don't try to execute and get your whole order held. And of course, if it's light green, there's more than a thousand shares. But again, if there's less than the number of shares you want, then your order will be held. And of course, I'm not going to show that with these because I don't want to actually get executed. So that's it. Check me out next time, reapertrades.com.